Hello everybody, welcome back to another It's Green Forever video, and today we're going to be playing Sonic 1 Anniversary Edition. So this is like a hack of Sonic 1. So last year we played Sonic 2 Anniversary Edition, which like, is the wrong hack of Sonic, oh, what's it called? Sonic 2. <laughs> and we're also going to play that again on the channel because there was a new update. So yeah, this is like, so it just basically remasters like the graphics and there's other, other cool things. And there's also, so you have the Sega screen, and then the 30th anniversary thing, and this little Sonic hacking contest thing, and then Sonic Team logo. So yeah. I'm, gonna turn, I'm just kind of adjusting the volume. I can barely hear myself, so I'm just gonna... Yeah, let's do... <laughs> Let me just lower the volume a bit. There we go. Also, when you get hit, you don't lose rings, but only for like the first time afterwards, you will get like hit. I don't know why that's a feature, but I mean, it's cool. You get a little bit of immunity. So, yeah. So, as you can clearly see, the graphics are remastered. It looks very nice. So also, today's Sonic Generation's 10th anniversary was the Wiss, which I just realized, like, a few minutes ago, so... Yeah, you know, I mean, the whole game is about classic Sonic and anniversary, so, you know, why not? Let's see- oh, oh, oh wait, also, I didn't realize this, but, like, he does, like, the little jumping animation. But, I, I wanna- so we're gonna see the special stages, so... Yeah, as you can clearly see, they look updated as well. They look a little bit more transparent, like the those blocks. And these blocks also look much more transparent. And yeah, everything has like a fresh coat of paint. Very nice. Also, Sonic has that like dot, like on him uh, at all times, so that's kind of cool. Okay, also, question of the day. What is your favorite Sega Genesis Sonic game? And I'm also gonna include Sonic CD, or, yeah, like, Sega CD or 32X games. Cause, yeah. Also, as you can see, the palette has changed for this level. It's, like, slight, slightly brighter, I think. There's, like, yeah, it's more brighter. So, yeah, that's another thing. The palette's changed, so that's really cool. Also, yeah, the walls don't... Fall. Or well, like I, I'm not, I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure in the original you like you can fall through like those like rising platforms or whatever. I don't know. Another special stage. Okay. Let's get this emerald, and... yeah. Oh, no, no, I went... I got... I think I got a 1-up or continue, I don't know. <laughs> I just heard the da 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 ding whatever. Oh. Yeah, I think, like, the, the sounds are actually upgraded. Like, that sounded, like, more higher quality than, like, the original Genesis version. I'm not sure, though. It could just be placebo, because, like, obviously... The whole game is, like, new. Maybe it's like something to do with the fact I'm using a white screen emu emulator. Also, I, I didn't mention this, but the Chaos Emeralds also like, they look closer to their modern designs. And also, now Green Hill Zone looks more, uh, sunset-y. That's cool. Also, as you saw in the options menu at the beginning, Eggman actually has like, he actually talks. Like, it's not like a lot, but like, if you like hit him, like he makes a noise, I think, and then like when he arrives, just other things. So, you know, that's pretty cool. I don't know why, but the music sounds like it's like faster than it should be. I don't know. Oh, wait, I, didn't, I, I wanted the, the thing. Also, if you're wondering how I'm playing the games in widescreen, so in Retroarch, there's a new emulator called Genesis Plus GX Wide. And for, like, certain games, you can just use it just fine. Also, you can't hit Eggman while he's coming down on, like, the original. And also, you could hear him talk. So, yeah. So, it's called Genesis Plus GX Wide. 
So, if, so in certain games, you can just use it in the emulator. But for like Sonic 1 and 2, you have to like... But like go to like this website like oh well, just you can just look it up and then like you have to patch the ROM and yeah wait <laughs> it's in Japanese so I mean I guess that makes sense you know so now he, he pushes up oh, I don't know what happened there <laughs> so yeah anyway oh he, he just bounced away <laughs> okay uh so like, I, I, I kind of closed the game, so in to increase the video length, I'm gonna play through the first act of Marvel Zone, cause why not? <laughs> and as you can clearly see again, the, the stage has been updated to look more, well not HD, but it's just higher quality. So yeah. Let's go through here, and we got an extra shield. Okay, that's different. <laughs> it's kind of going for a th different, like, I forgot, I don't know what it's called. It's like a different, like, melody. Instead of, like, going do 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 do. It's kind of just going, like, yeah. It's, like, different. <laughs> but, like, still, like, the same, like, kind of, like, that. Go up here. Sir, no, no. <laughs> okay, bruh. Okay, don't worry. You can still go up here. And let's. And we have beaten the level. And let's do the special stage and yeah. So yeah. If you notice like something's disappearing, that's because like I don't know why, but I guess they didn't really optimize the special stage to like not like have things disappear in the widescreen emulator. Cause yeah, they I mean, it's not really that much, but like it's still kind of weird. Cause like some things do still show up, but some of them just kinda disappear. Up, oh, almost there. And we have gone in the third Chaos Emerald. Anyways, that'll be the end of this video. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you never miss when I upload. Comment down below because I appreciate your feedback and support, and share the video so more people see it. Uh, thanks for watching, happy November, and happy 10th anniversary to Sonic Generations. Goodbye!